effect of pepsin on milk. Place 3 ml of milk in each of the tested tubes. Place 0.5 ml water in one tube. 0.5 ml of pepsin in another. And 0.5 ml of boiled pepsin in the third. Mix and place in a water bath at 37 Celsius for 20 minutes. Record your results and explain in your lab report. If you add pepsin to milk, you can expect the pepsin to start digesting the proteins into smaller polypeptides in the form of coagulation. But if you add a boiled pepsin to milk, you can expect no changes, no coagulation, because when you boil pepsin enzyme, it will be denatured, so there is no effect of pepsin on milk.